Ladies and gentlemen, uh, today, this morning, it is an, uh, the launching ceremony of the online resources for learning in English, or in short, MyLine. UTM, as an innovation university, has always strived to play an active role in helping the nation become a contributor to, rather than merely a consumer of knowledge, in the field of science and technology. English, without a doubt, plays an important role in this endeavor. To support enhancement of competence in the English language, UTM initiated a formal support program in 2005 called the English Language Support Program, or ELSP, for the students and the staff. ELSP for the students complements the existing compulsory English language courses in the university to develop competence and confidence among the students in the use of English for academic and professional purposes. It is part of an integrated approach to develop the generic skills identified in the UTM graduate attributes, especially communication skills. We decided at the conceptualization stage of ELSP that instead of emphasizing on teaching and even more teaching, we would have to adopt an approach that emphasizes learning and students' responsibility for self-development. Our strategy was, and still is, to create an acquisition-rich environment in the university, conducive to the development of communication skills in English, encourage students to take responsibility for their own learning, and provide learning support when support is required. The main aim still is to develop a culture of responsibility for self-directed learning and nurture a community of self-directed learners in the university who could, who could take charge of their own learning and self-development. Therefore, ELSP is intended to provide the support services needed to nurture such lifelong and independent learning skills. The services offered come in different modes, peer support, one-on-one -on -one support, short taught courses, and web-based self-assess learning. It is the web-based self-assess learning service in the form of the online resources for learning in English that has proven to be popular among the students. And it is this resource that has brought us all together here in our collaborative effort at contributing to the development of versatile graduates capable of taking on the challenges of an increasingly interdependent world. Ladies and gentlemen, initiated with a grant from the university and facilitated, facilitated by the infrastructural ICT facilities in the universities, the online resources for learning in English is consistent with UTM's emphasis on harnessing the full potential of technology to improve the quality of teaching and learning. I'm glad our students have found the learning resource compatible with their learning preference, as it allows them to learn at their own pace, place, and time. This is, however, merely the first step in the long journey of continuous improvement. While it is heartening to know that there is growing awareness among our students on the need to take charge of their own self-redevelopment, or self-development, as seen in the growing participation in the non-compulsory activities in ELSP, this awareness will have to be sustained over time to produce the desired outcome. On the part of the university, we are aware of the need not only to persistently promote the culture of self-directed learning through innovative activities, but also to monitor the impact of the support services. This need to monitor the impact of the program is in line with the current emphasis on outcome and evidence-based learning. Toward this end, UTM has initiated a project, the Test for English Communication Skills for Graduating Students, to objectively measure the readiness of its graduating students to communicate effectively in English at the workplace. This latest effort will not only help set a benchmark for the students to achieve, but also give the stakeholders in education, especially the employers, an indication of UTM's great